You've probably heard the great quote that says, what you measure gets improved. And if you're not measuring how your e-commerce store is doing, how can you actually improve it? How do you know what to improve if you don't know where things are broken or where things are underperforming? This brand new Shopify app promises to change all of that. It provides a comprehensive dashboard of all the numbers and analytics and performance data that you need to make better decisions on how to increase profits and increase sales in your e-commerce store. Hey, what's up? Welcome back if you're a current subscriber here. If you're brand new, it's good to meet you. My name's Kerry, I'm the founder of Shirt School, and I created this channel to bring you the best strategies, secrets, and hacks to grow your online t-shirt, apparel store, or e-commerce business. Today, I'm going to review a new Shopify app called Nostradamus.cloud. It is a really cool app that I've been working with for the past couple of weeks that measures your performance in analytics. It gives you the numbers and the data that you need in a very easy to follow and easy to understand format in a dashboard so that you can improve your store, make tweaks, and really increase profits and sales. One of the biggest issues I see in working with so many e-commerce sellers throughout my programs and courses is that most people just don't know what is good and what is bad. What is good performance? What is bad performance? They don't know their numbers, their KPIs, or their analytics. And just by knowing a few use certain metrics inside of your Shopify store, you can make huge strides and huge improvements in boosting your sales, revenues, and profits. And the Shopify app I am reviewing today gives you an easy to use, easy to follow dashboard that shows you the numbers that you need to know right now. It's gonna automatically update all that for you. And the best part is they have a completely free plan that I wanna tell you about at the end of the video. So let's dive into the review. We're looking at the main dashboard of the Nostradamus.cloud Shopify app. Now, once you install the Shopify app, it's automatically, automatically gonna connect, pull all your data in, and it's gonna give you these really important numbers that you need to know. Now, if at first you look at this app and it might be maybe looks like a lot to take in, I wanna break it down very simply for you, and I wanna show you how easy it can be. Now, depending on what kind of store you have, you may not use everything inside of this app. It's very robust and it provides a lot of data that you need. So I'm gonna show you some of the most important things that I think pretty much every e-commerce seller should be looking at. So everything starts right here on the health check screen. Now, even on the free plan, every type of account is gonna get access to this health check screen. Now, what this does is it gives you this overall score of how your store is doing, and it's gonna break down metrics that you need to know, and it's simply gonna give you this green, red, and yellow indication of what needs to be improved. Now, right here on the front health check dashboard, you see things like gross profit, uh, your storage gross profit. Um, you see things like your uh, unfulfilled orders that need to be fulfilled. You see um, new customers in the past 30 days, new versus returning, kind of showed you that ratio. There's so much important stuff here down in the uh, products category. Again, you see that red, yellow, and green. It'll show you what's going out of stock or what you have excess stock in or what products are out of stock. And you can click into any of these categories to get a more detailed breakdown of these metrics. But I love that right here on the front main dashboard screen that you get a really quick view of overall how your store is doing. Red, yellow, green gives you that score. And then it also showed you just right with the quick look what areas in your store that you might need to improve or might be doing well. Uh, and so I love that, that I just at a quick glance, you really get a big picture of how your store is doing. Over here on the left side of the app, you're gonna see five main categories, sales and finances, operations, customers, products, and benchmarks. Now, rather than taking you through every single feature that this app has, because there is a lot, I wanna take you through some of the main features that I think will be most useful for you. Starting off in the sales and finances category, now obviously there's gonna be a lot of great data here, but I love that you can see your gross margin, the number of orders you've recently had, and the net sales that you've had uh, right here in the sales category. Wait a second. Over 80% of people watching this video right now are not subscribed to the channel. So you need to take just one second, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notifications when we release new videos. If you're watching this, you likely have an e-commerce store and you want to make more sales and profits. And that's what we help you do on this channel. So you need to subscribe.
Next, if we go over to the customer tab, there is some really, really useful information in this category. Now, first thing is up here on the right, we can change the date. We can actually see past week, month. We can see data from that. And what you're gonna see right here on the front of this dashboard, your new versus returning customers for that, that date period. You're gonna see your total amount of customers for that period and the new customers you had versus uh, repeat customers. Now, what I wanna show you here is if we click on customer groups, I love this feature. We have our gold customers. These are our most active and profitable customers. They represent 75% of your total revenue. We have our silver customers, about 20% of our revenue. And we have our bronze customers that represent about 5% of our sales. Now, what this tells us at a very quick glance, either in this kind of table here, or we can go down and look at the data here individually, uh, what this tells us is who are our best customers? Because then we can make decisions on maybe we should market to those guys more and sell to them more because they are loyal and they will spend money. So we can make them special loyalty offers. We can make better decisions on how we're going to market to them. Maybe our gold and silver customers, we might wanna do a special offer to entice them as opposed to our bronze customers. This helps you see, you can also see things like is it men, is it women, or what are the age groups? This is gonna give you a better idea of who your best customers are. And that is a, a very, very important thing to know inside your store. You can also see your new customers for that date period. And that will give you an idea of how many new customers are you bringing in versus existing customers. It might help you decide, do you need to ramp up your marketing to cold traffic or maybe ramp up your marketing to your existing customers? This is all very important data to know. Next on the product tab, this is probably my favorite tab because I think it has some of the most important data in the whole app. But you see, it's gonna be very similar to the way that the other tabs have worked uh, with how it's set up. It's gonna give you some important data right here on the front of the screen. We're gonna see our average order value, which is awesome. It's one of the most important things we need to know. We're gonna see uh, stock, average days in stock, how many products, uh, all those kind of things. But what's most important to me is right here. It says top five product uh, sales behavior changes. So you can see what products have increased or decreased the most over that time period, right? So that gives you a great idea, a uh, great look at what is popular and what is not popular. We can also see here, top five products predicted sales behavior changes in the future. This is one thing I haven't talked about much, but another crazy feature of Nostradamus is that it has built in artificial intelligence that can predict what your sales are going to be like in the near future. And again, this is gonna help you make marketing decisions. Do you need to ramp up your ad spend? Do you need to market a certain product more than others? You can see those kind of trends in your store so much clearer with this app. And so I think it's really important for a couple reasons that you know what products are really trending and that you actually look at the data. I know in my own stores, a lot of times I feel like a product is really crushing it. And then when I actually go look at the data, it might be another product crushing it, or maybe the product I thought was selling isn't selling as well. And it really helps me make those decisions. So you need to know what products are stinking and what products are doing really well. And another thing that helps you with is uh, building your store, making your store easier to navigate, lessening decision fatigue, because there might be products in your store that are old or are not selling that you need to remove. If nobody's buying it, you don't want it there just clouding up their your customer's decision making. So again, this is such a great tool for finding out which products are good, which products are bad, and, ma and making decisions that you can optimize your store with. If we click on the product group button, we get a very familiar look, just like we looked at with the customers, of what are our gold products, silver products, and bronze products. And this gives you a great look at what products are making most of your revenue, or less revenue, and so on and so forth. One more quick thing I wanna show you is under the operation operations tabs, we can click on returns. And again, this will show you what items are being returned the most and also what customers are doing the most returns. Very important to know. One of my favorite things about this app is that they have three different plans and the entry level plan is completely free forever. It's not a trial and it's going to come with this health check dashboard. And it's also going to come with the benchmarks feature over here on the left. And again, this is completely free. So I think everybody watching this video should install this app completely free. You don't have to spend any money just to have it to see some of this data that you need. If you wanna try out their standard or professional app, they have a 14 day free trial for both of those plans. So you can get in on the free plan forever and you can try out the standard plan or the professional plan 
for 14 days completely free. Now on the standard plan, you're going to get all of those dashboards that we showed you today. On the professional plan, you're going to get the AI sales predictions, the artificial intelligence. But one more feature that I think you need to know about is their e-commerce coach. And that comes with the professional plan. Now, if we just read here, it says e-commerce coach gives you actionable recommendations based on your business performance. If we quickly go back over to the app, you're going to see this little eye here. And this eye will actually give you personalized recommendations on how to improve your store. And with the e-commerce coach, they have an entire area of their website that is dedicated to these in-depth uh, tips and training and articles that will help you improve your store based on what data it is showing in the app. It's very intelligent and very useful. If you'd like to try out the Nostradamus app, just use the link down in the description to head over to the Shopify app store, hit the add app button, and this will install into your store with just one click. And again, everybody's going to get access to that completely free forever plan and get a 14 day free trial on one of the higher tiered plans to give that a shot. See you next week.